This is lines 203 to 209 of Ovid's account of Daedalus and Icarus. It also corresponds to section 3 of stage 44 in the Cambridge Latin course, the 5th edition. Um, in 203, Daedalus is, uh, has made the wings, and now he is putting them on his son. And in Struid at Natum, and he equips his son and says, and now medio ut limite coras icare, we need to take moneo first here. So we have a, an indirect command clause. So Icarus, I warn, and we assume you, well, I warn you to, to, to go or to, uh, we could say fly here, I suppose, by the middle course. So moneo ut, I warn you to fly or go by the middle route, by the middle of the course, so that, so that something doesn't happen, okay? So that, the unda grawet penas, so that the water or the waves don't weigh down your wings if you fly lower, or maybe we could say too low here for the comparative. And then we have another part and I warn you to fly by the middle course so that the fire doesn't burn your wings if you will go Ibis Calcior. So if you will go higher or too high. So Ne Grawet and Ne Adurat, those are the two parts of the purpose clause here. So his command here is Wola, fly, fly between Utrumque, each of them. And then we see the neck here, so he's going to tell him not to do something again. And this time he uses Ubeo. So I order you not to spectare. So remember, Ubeo takes an infinitive, not a subjunctive clause. It's the same idea, right? I warn you not to do this. Uh, here I order you not to, but Ubeo takes an infinitive instead of the subjunctive. So I warn you, or I, I order you not to look at Bootes, uh, a constellation, and this, here's the Greek accusative again, or Helike, which is the great bear, and the unsheathed sword of Orion. He says, me duque, with me as the leader. So we have an ablative absolute here. With me as your leader, take that path or seize that way. At the same time, he hands over the, the, the orders, the commands of flying. Here we have a, a gerund. And he fits or places the unknown wings onto his son's shoulders, onto Icarus's shoulders. And this ignotas is a callback from just a few lines above when Icarus was said by Ovid to demit it his animum into the ignotas artes. So here the ignotas alas, the result, the product of those ignotas artes.